Okay, so here we are in Lightroom. I've got an image up on my screen. It's uh, as shot. It's a vertical image. I want to put it on Instagram. So there's a few things I can do. One is, the first thing I need to do is I need to crop it. And I need to crop it in a one-to-one. -one. So here are my crop try, uh, box. I choose one-to-one. -one. There's a crop, and I find the crop that I like. Actually, I want to one more angle on that, like that. All right, then I hit return. So I've cropped it. It's one-to-one -one on the sides. What I want to do now is I want to export it. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to build, actually I'm going to build a preset for export to Instagram. And I'll show you how to do that. It'll end up in this export with preset box, so it'll always be available. So I'm going to export. Um, I'm going to export to a specific folder, and the folder I'm going to choose to export to will be in Dropbox. I'm going to make a new folder in Dropbox called Instagram from Lightroom, from LR, from LR, from Lightroom. Create that folder. That's where I want my exports to end up. So it'll be easy for me on my iPad or my iPhone to upload to Instagram because Dropbox is on those devices, so it'll show up automatically. Okay, I've got that. I've got that. Now I'm going to rename it. What I want is I want to name. Uh, I'm going to... Let's see where I do this. Uh, rename to... Here we go. Edit. And I want to rename some custom text, and I want to put the original file name. I'm going to insert that and get rid of the sequence numbers. So my original file name, right now it says that, but I'm going to change it. So click done. But I'm going to change what the custom text says to Instagram. Instagram. Dash. So this is what the file name will look like, Instagram, the original file number, and there's a JPEG. Okay, no video. I want it to be a JPEG to upload. I want the quality to be okay, which is probably 70, 70, 80, that's fine. sRGB, I definitely want chosen because it's on a device. It's on the web. Um, I want to resize that. I'm going to resize it to fit and use it 640. And the uh, long edge, since it's square, since it's square, it doesn't matter. Or we can just do width and height to be the same thing. 640 pixels by 640 pixels. Resolution doesn't really matter, but put 72 because people have a passion for that. I want to sharpen it for the screen, not for paper, because it's not going to be printed. Or it might be printed later, but it's going to be shown on the screen. Now before I say export, I'm going to do add over here on the left hand side. I'm going to do add and I'm going to call this Instagram 640 by 640. So it'll know. And it'll be in the folder, the user, pre the user presets folder. That's all right. And I'll click create. And now it shows up right there. And that's what it has. It has these settings. It's got those things. And then if I were to click Export, it would end up in that folder. Right? And it'll process. And I made it. And let's go and look for it. So if I were to look here in the Finder, uh, let me open a Finder window and in Dropbox. There's Instagram from Lightroom, and in that folder is this. And if I do that and check that folder, it's I'm in Instagram from Lightroom, in Dropbox. I open that, and it tells me it's 640 by 480. It tells me that other info that I don't care about. It's got that Instagram gram with the original image name, um, and it's all set to go. So if I open this on my iPad, in Dropbox, I'll find that, and from Dropbox, I can upload it to Instagram. It's pretty simple, actually. Now, the next time I come along, let me find another image. Uh, this guy. So it's 
Uh, I've got I've still got to go to square. I'm going to square crop. Crop it one to one is still the crop setup for me. So I go make sure it's a square crop. And then I go over to, let me fill my little picture here, file and export with preset this time. And notice we have the misspelled Instagram right here. And all I have to do is click on that and it will export that to the same folder as we did before. Here's the Dropbox, here's the folder, here's the second one there. And if I do Command I, we look at it, it's 640 by 640, all set to go up to Instagram. Pretty cool, eh? There you go.